everyone, welcome back to my channel, Alex here. If you've never seen these big old cheeks before, then do go ahead and hit that subscribe button before you leave. And most important, turn on your bell notifications. And what that's gonna do is gonna set a push to your phone to let you know every single time I upload a brand new video. So today I have a wig review for you guys. I haven't done one of these in a long time, so hence why my hair is all braided up, okay? I have not put on my stocking cap yet because I wanted my braids to get a little bit of air because I haven't braided my hair in a long time. I'm not that great at it, but um, it's, 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 it is what it is, okay? I, I braided my own hair <laughs> as I normally do, but I really liked this wig and this unit is from Outre and it is the DeVita. I hope you guys can see that. I hope it's not getting washed out. If not, I'll just insert a photo of the card. And this one is supposed to be one of their HD transparent lace units. And it's gonna have five inches of Swiss lace and an L part with natural baby hairs. I really, really like this style. It is on the shorter side in terms of what I normally wear. So it's gonna probably hit me about here. It comes in about nine or so different colors. And I decided to get the color 1B. This is heat resistant up to, it says 400 degrees Fahrenheit so I haven't cut the lace or anything like that because I wanted you guys to see her as she is a little bit of shine there nothing a little bit of um, baby powder or cornstarch or something that I can't fix but I do love the curl pattern very very nice like I said it is a shorter unit for me I felt like I wanted something that would be easy to throw on you guys know a lot of us are working from home so I just wanted something that would be easy to throw on a quick zoom meeting I don't have to do my hair that kind of thing so I really like her this is cute. I love, love, love these little curls. They are bouncy. Ooh. Oh my. The hair is soft. Oh yes. Okay. Hair is super soft. Let's see this parting space, shall we? All of that parting space. Check that out. So yeah, that is a good, that is a good five inches. That's really, really, really far back there. And the lace seems to be a little light little bit light you can see it right there against my hand um, but nothing a little bit of powder can't fix I don't need to pluck this because the parting space is pretty good you can kind of see it right there we've got a, a good space so what I'm gonna go ahead and do is show you the inside as well We've got a comb right here, two combs on the side, one comb at the bottom per usual, and then also two adjustable straps at the bottom. But the baby hairs, they're not baby hairs. These are short hairs in the front. They are long, so do be mindful of that. Like that's a baby hair. That's a short hair. So super long. What I'm gonna go ahead and do is plop her on and um, cut this lace and I'll be back to share with you what she looks like. Again, this is Outre de Vida. Okay guys, caps on and I cut off the lace. As you can see, there it is right there. It is a light lace and it is stretchy. It's not that hard lace that you know some units can have. So I wanted to put her on on camera and show you guys what she looks like before I do any type of adjustments or, you know, combing out or anything like that. Just wanted you to see her before I do anything else. Okay, she is big head friendly. Very, very nice. She's not tight. She is very comfortable. Very, very comfortable. Definitely big head friendly. If you want to know the circumference for my head, I am about 22.5. Last time I checked. <laughs> hey guys, here is Davida. She's cute. Oh, I like her. Now I haven't fixed anything up in here. I noticed though, because she is big head friendly, this section isn't staying down as snug as it could be, but I think that's nothing that can't be fixed with um, adjusting the straps in the back. So that's definitely something that I am going to do. But I do like the style. What do you guys think? I need to come out some of these curls that are really, really, um, how do you say, tight. So let's come out some of those. As far as shedding, I am getting shedding like maybe four or five strands. Yeah, nothing bad, nothing, nothing horrible. Oh my goodness, Davida, yes. Mm hmm I love the Vita. And this is her fresh out of the box. I haven't done anything to it, like I said. I only combed it out just now, cut off the lace, and that's it. Oh my goodness. I just wanted you guys to see her 
before I do anything else to her. Like I said, she does come in a number of colors and I just might get her in some other colors because this is bomb. Ooh. I love the height she has up here. You can definitely press this down if you wanted like a flatter look, but I do like the little hump right here. I don't know why. Like I like the volume right there. It's very, very, very nice. So, oh, she is, she is gorgeous. What do you guys think? Let me know down in the comment section. What do you think? Like first impressions, right? Like fresh out of the box kind of impressions. All right, so I'm gonna turn to the side and I'm gonna kind of turn to the back so you can see what the back looks like. And then I'm definitely gonna come back um, all done up with setting her in place and with my final thoughts. Okay guys, so I am back with Davida and let me tell you how hard Davida worked me. The video worked me hard in terms of trying to conceal that lace. Like the unit is beautiful, it's big head friendly, the hair is soft, the hair is body and movement and everything. But Ultra really, like Ultra, if you're watching this, you really messed up with this lace. Like it's so light that I have to dig for the baby to find it. And I will tell you guys right now, if you decide to get the Vita, put her on a wig head the day or the night before you want to wear her, put her on there so that the hump can come down. I did put a little bit of heat on top just to try and bring the hump down a little bit. Even though I do like the height, um, it kind of looked lopsided for a little bit there. Or you can just tie it down, but go in, find those baby hairs the night before or whatever, and shape them the night before because they are hard to find because they are short hairs. They're not baby hairs, they're really long, so they're all mixed up in there with the regular hair, and it was just, Oh, it was hard finding that I only found a few. I was like, I just have to make this video for you guys to just tell y'all how hard it was to find them. So super, super hard to find. But when I did find the ones that I needed to show you guys this unit, I just found it, slipped it down with some, uh, some got to be glue and it's good to go. The, the parting is really nice. Um, the knots are visible, so do go in ahead with your powder or concealer or whatever to go in and deal with this part right here. I do like the shape of it. I do like the depth of it, so very, very nice. I like that it's a pre-plucked in there, and it's also pre-plucked around the hairline, so they did a, a good job with that, but again, the lace was just making it really difficult um, to conceal anything because it is so, like, so light, guys. Like I know on camera it might look that way, but this this is some um, you could probably see it a bit. This is this is some um, the lace is light, okay? It's let me put it here. You can see that? Yeah, it's light. All right, it's it's light. So they messed up there. But other than that, the hair is cute. The wig itself is big head friendly, like I said, and I do I do like the hair. I like the fact that it's soft. So you can see here, it does have a body and a movement. I like the fact that the curls do come out on their own when you run your fingers through it. I'm not getting a lot of shedding or anything like that, but it's a cute everyday wig um, if you just wanted something simple, something fun to throw on and go. All right, you guys, let me know down in the comment section what you think of Outre's Devita. Uh, let me know how you feel about this unit. Like I said, I like it. It's just, it's a lot of work because of the lace. The lace is light and that makes it just a lot of work to deal with. Like having to figure out how to conceal that, especially like if you're a newcomer to wigs, like then you've got this cute unit that's really easy to wear and then you've got this light lace to deal with. All right, you guys, do let me know down in the comment section what you thought about today's video. Don't forget to comment something and thumbs it up and I'll see you in my next video really, really soon. Bye.